uh, consider me as a uh, beginner as well so uh, how does it give me value from the from the starting to end um, especially i'm looking for uh, connecting to the devices external devices doing the live loop those kind of things so and completely about the ableton uh, software itself what's your medium or th- thing that you use okay though i'm using ableton i'm using innovation uh, midi controller i have tried to explore many things but it doesn't work as uh, even if i look at youtube videos sometimes it gets out of the hand and then i'll stop it in 2 hours or 3 hours i think this is the big problem with music production it's uh it's not so much that um there's not enough information there's actually too much information it's the opposite problem and so when you have all the information at your fingertips it's really hard to know what's the right step forward to help you kind of like get to the next step basically and so i mean i've spent quite a lot of time making a lot of different types of music and uh over the years i've come up with kind of like a a process and within the process of each section i have things that i will suggest that you should cover and in kind of like what kind of steps you know like i think mm-hmm. the hardest the hardest parts of music production that most people don't understand or don't give credit to is editing and mixing those are like the two most time consuming parts of music production the songwriting part is the easy part writing the music is the easy part um finding sounds is actually quite a time consuming part of the process um but once you find the sounds you like to work with and then once you it becomes really fun to play with them but then editing and then mixing and knowing what to do in what order is not that straightforward so having like part of the master class's aim is actually to give you a framework so next time when you need to mix a song you have this template that you go through and you go like step by step by step by step and you kind of like like end up finishing like at least something that's kind of at least like professional in its uh, approach basically when i started off mixing i never had a framework so what happens when you don't have a system is that you keep moving in circles so you'll make one decision i'll change the sound here i'll make this decision here and then you'll do something else and then you'll come back and you'll be like oh no now that i've changed the other stuff i've got a this thing has already changed in relation to the other thing and then you go in circles just like tweaking left right and tweaking the wrong things basically so part of like this masterclass is it's going to give you like this like format and template so when you start to tweak you go like with a systematic step by step kind of instruction of okay now i'm just going to start first with the kick drum i'm just going to work on the kick drum make sure the sound hits a certain level i'm going to tune it and you know like once you're done with the kick drum then you move to the next sound i'm going to go to the bass and then i'm going to make sure that the bass has this level that it's matching with the kick you know so you kind of have this this skeleton that you can work with and you can modify the skeleton to whatever your process is um over time but i'll give you that basic framework to help you to move forward so so you don't spend hours and hours going through youtube videos and stuff like that <laughs>